What is up YouTube? My name is Sam here with Shared Moments Captured. Today we're gonna do a dual vlog. Sierra's back at her family house. She's gonna be doing a few things and today I'm gonna be doing a few things on my own. So we'll hit dual vlogs today. I'm not really sure what we'll get of today, but that's with life, right? You gotta make the best of it. Hey everyone, what's up? So we're back at it again with another dual vlog. Um, I'm gonna be spending the day with my mom again, helping her with this stuff right here. You know, graduation party stuff. Um, like I said before, she's always doing stuff for my family. So this is what we got going on today. So we're meeting up with my mom for breakfast here at Koa Pancakes. I haven't had this place for maybe like five years, but I know they have kimchi fried rice and I love kimchi fried rice. All right guys, so we ordered and we got our food and nothing makes me happier than seeing local Hawaiian food for breakfast. Chocolate banana pancakes. Chocolate pancakes. Oh, the candy hash is looking action. Wow, what is that? Smoky bacon, half inch thick. Easy. Out of time. Get back in. Turkey, mushroom. Chives, tomatoes, side tomatoes, no starches. You know that. I'm getting back into it. Let's go. We finished up breakfast at a Koa Pancake House. They actually switched the name over to Kanye Pancake House. But we're over here at Nanko Fishing Supplies in Kanye. It's one of our childhood uh, stomping grounds. We love this place. And uh, Tommy's gonna get some fishing gear so he could go off and uh, and go fishing. So we just got to my auntie's house. Um, we're gonna start setting up some stuff and then building some stuff. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to get on video, but I'll try my best to get as much as I can. Oh my gosh, my hair looks ratchet today. Anyways, yeah, I'll try my best to get um, as much footage as I can. Bye. In the back, we got a blue bag that was like a little bit red. Looks like a bag. Ready? <laughs> We're back at the house. We actually got some fishing supplies. But guys, I am peeling and it's ridiculous. Oh my god. Bring up some gear for us to go out. Yeah, you. Let's see what we could catch. So like I said in the past videos, Bruce was our dog that me and Sierra picked up from one of my best friends, Morgan, uh, when he was a pup. But we had to leave for college, so he ended up getting trained by my mom and dad or basically the household. So there's some things he's lacking and every time I come home for summer, I try and like, you know, work on a few things for his uh, learning abilities. <laughs> but uh, remember last video with the, a couple videos ago actually with the centipede and I was like, oh, this is his favorite hangout spot. He actually just learned how to like, you know, leave the toy instead of taking it with him constantly so we could play fetch. He left me the ball to throw around and uh, he's right back at his spot. He's out right under there. He wants you to throw the ball, but he leaves the ball just far enough for him to like run back to that spot and get ready. But man, he's just been waiting there this whole time I'm talking. Let's give him this ball. There you go, Bruce. Good boy. Oh my God, I'm super peeling. Like I said, we're gonna be setting up some fishing gear and then me and Tommy will be heading over to one of our favorite spots here in Kailua uh, to go fishing. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we get shopping. <laughs> to one of our favorite fishing spots. I'm not sure on how windy it is over here, so I'm gonna try and talk real loud for you guys. But uh, Tommy's setting up the jig line right now, and we're gonna cast it out over here. Yeah. Oh, 
Alrighty guys, so we got the lines in the water, so we have some time to talk. And I was kind of watching some of my videos that we put out in this last week. Some of the videos never really, through the, through the post edit, they never really came out uh, the way I wanted them to. Like some of the videos where we were like, oh, you know, we'll put a picture here. Um, and it never showed the picture. I don't know why that is. I'm doing a lot of the editing on my mobile device right now. So when, once we get back to Utah, the production value of these videos are definitely going, gonna go up a little bit. We have mo a little more camera gear and a, definitely a better computer to do a lot of this editing on. So I just kind of wanted to touch up on that a little bit if you guys are kind of worried about the, the production value of these videos. They're gonna go up as time goes and as, as we kind of get a little more used to vlogging and capturing these moments. So far, so good. We're really enjoying it. Um, we're, me and Sierra were just talking the other night and we we're saying how how uh you know we've been wanting to do this and now that we're actually doing it it's just come into us a, a more naturally than we thought it would have just wanted to quickly touch up on that because it was something that was bugging me yesterday when i was reviewing some of the videos if you're from hawaii you know what the manapua man is if you don't know what the manapua man is basically it's a guy that drives around in a van sells some ice cream sells some manapua sells some candy super chill i'm in nalo and that's usually where they he comes by, so I'm gonna show you guys who the Manapu man is. Are you gonna get something, Mubu? Uh, you got more money? Get it, get it. Wait, you're gonna get what? Where are you going? Candy. Candy? Me too. I got money for you. I got money for you, man. Don't worry. Happy Tom. It's kind of one of those things that happen when you go fishing. You're gonna lose gear inevitably. It's just a bummer when you just get it and you lose it. Oh. Not gum, something else. Got it. Oh, there it is. You can see it. It's almost stuck on a fat piece of seaweed. Wow. Yeah, you. The survival. I let it go all the way down. I let the line go all the way down. So the line was like, here's the shore and here's the hook. Yeah. I let the line go all the way here and then I yanked it and it pulled it out. I'm fucking yeah. <laughs> Tom, your pole looks a little fucked up. So, I just got a couple of candies. But as you guys could see, there's literally a whole bunch of food that you could get. Uh, musubi, burrito, there's like manapua. Anyways, it's pretty cool that he's like legit and he goes around and sells out of his bag. And that's, you know, that's how you do it, man. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so Tommy was actually able to save his uh, his brand new lure. So that ended up working out pretty well for us. 
but the jig that we were using on the other set we lost it to the ocean it happens unfortunately there is a hook in the wana but uh the, hook, the hooks we were using are designed to kind of degrade after time so it is what it is but uh this spot that we're at is just it's amazing so this is uh this is a little coastline that we walked down to get to that little fishing spot but uh we're gonna move a little little inwards towards land there is a mouth of a river right there with our gear set up where it, it'll be a little better for us it's a little rough today for the with the waves and everything so going a little more inland the water will be a little more smooth and uh be able to fish a little better ah, just on my so we made it down to a new location and tommy's pole broke i don't know if you guys were able to see that in the last clip but tommy's pole snapped the poles just get trashed by the weather here in hawaii but uh we're macgyvering it we're making do anything anything can happen with duct tape do, 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 do. Ah, did someone say cosmic? Something black in this pole, you gotta catch it on. Alright right, guys, so in the last couple clips, you saw Tommy duct taping our broken rod. That didn't last long. On our second cast out, it snapped in half and it's done. So I got part of it sitting right here actually. It's just a small pole. It's the other set of it, we're still using it down over there. So hopefully we catch something. Well, unfortunately, the sun is coming down and we still have yet to catch anything. But that is the way it is when you go fishing. You just gotta go and enjoy the moment. I do believe I'm gonna be ending it here. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please like, like comment, comment, and, and subscribe. subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Shoot. Yeah. Preparing for tomorrow. We have an early day in the morning. <laughs> we need to get this shit now. <laughs>